there's someone who predicted like nobody else how Leo Messi's career would turn out. And he made it 15 years ago. Join us as we unveil Johan Cruyff's prediction about Leo Messi in 2008. Oh my goalers, the world then was very different from the world as it is today. Real Madrid had not won a Champions League for 16 years. Cristiano Ronaldo was a huge star in the Premier League. And Lionel Messi? Well, he was a mere 20-year-old who had less than 40 goals in professional football, still sporting his signature long locks and that iconic number 19. However, at the beginning of 2008, there were no doubts about the promising future that lay ahead. Today, almost 15 years later, we can confirm that everyone with their predictions for the phenom nicknamed La Pulga, all except Johan Cruyff. When I'm talking about Leo Messi today, we're talking about one of the most decorated players in the history of football. He's won every title a footballer could wish to win. If anyone were to predict such a formidable career, even when still dogged by injuries, it'd have to be someone who followed all the goings-on at the Camp Nou attentively. Although his days as a coach and player were long gone, Cruyff's influence on the day-to-day -day runnings of the Catalan club were huge. If you searched hard enough, there are a thousand headlines with his opinions about coaches and players who have played for Barcelona. But if you look for his first opinions about Lionel Messi, you'll be surprised. And let's give credit to the Dutchman. The Argentinian experienced hardship at the start of his career. 246 days out and seven injuries in three years, read AS back in 2008. Cruyff's prediction dates back to 2008, and it was made by a commentator during one of Barcelona's games. At the Camp Nou, Barcelona were playing in the second leg of the Copa del Rey quarterfinals. As he has done for the last 18 years, Messi was unplayable. After 30 minutes, with the 19-year-old having already terrorized the Villarreal defense, the commentator revealed, There's an interesting statement from Johan Cruyff, who still lives in the city and keeps coming to the Camp Nou regarding Lionel Messi. He says, even at 20, Messi has to learn a bit more about the game, when to give the right pass and when to dribble. In that he was right. At the time, Leo wasn't the playmaker he is now, and he didn't even take free kicks. Due to his speed, he could dribble past anyone. One defender, two. If he wanted to, he could take on the entire opposing team. But this is when the Dutchman's premonition was revealed. When he really learns that, he won't just win one Ballon d'Or. He'll have a whole collection of Ballon d'Ors by the end of his career. When you have a player like Cruyff saying that, you know you've made it. Two years later, with 10 trophies to his name, two Champions League titles and almost 200 professional matches and more than 100 goals scored, Messi would lift his first Ballon d'Or. Fifteen years later, with 42 trophies won, four Champions Leagues, one World Cup, over a thousand games and almost 800 goals, Messi has seven Ballon d'Ors and an eighth is on the way. Although they didn't share a close relationship, there was mutual respect between the two legends. The Argentine was even responsible for giving one of football's most beautiful tributes. That penalty against Celta de Vigo emulating what the Dutchman did while playing for Ajax. Remember when Messi was going to shoot, but he passed it to Luis Suarez instead? I was very excited about what Messi did. I don't know if he saw my play, but if someone could do that, it would be him. I saw right away that people were talking about my penalty. It's a joy to be remembered after so many years. It's nice. These are things that football gives you. Cruyff sadly passed away just a month after seeing Messi produce that penalty. By that time, the Argentine had already cemented his status as a footballing legend and had come good on Cruyff's initial prediction. And we have no doubt that wherever he is, Cruyff has been beaming with pride following Messi's latest achievements. If you enjoyed Messi's World Cup heroics as much as we did, you'll love watching the five best individual World Cup performances. Thanks for watching.